Here's a quick tip when editing out your pauses. Now when you edit out your pauses, do you do it like this? Or do you do it like this? Or could you even tell the difference? Now the difference between the two cuts is where the pause is. Now let me explain. Let's zoom in, Command Plus, and as you can tell, the pause is here. Now let's call this clip A and let's call this clip B for simplicity's sake. The pause, the natural pause, which is always good to have a little bit, is during clip B. And this is what it sounds like. Do it like this. Or do so the pause is in clip B. Whereas the second cut, again, let's call this clip A and let's call this clip B. The pause is in clip A. Do it like this. Or could you even... So as you can tell, as soon as clip B starts, I immediately start talking. Whereas in the first cut, there's a bit of a pause. Now, which one is the right one to do? It's personal preference, I think. However, what I like to do, I like the second one, where when the cut happens, I immediately start talking. And let's run it back the whole way through so you can see for yourself which one is better. Now, when you edit out your pauses, do you do it like this? Or do you do it like this? Or could you even tell the difference? So, overall, when you make your cuts, when editing out the silences to make it smoother, consider making the tail end of clip A longer than the start of clip B. And when clip B starts, consider making the audio start immediately as soon as it cuts. My name is Junius and I help people make and strategize educational content. And I have playlists helping you with exactly that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.